Good evening everyone and welcome to the Sussex Senior Challenge Cup semi-final between Hastings United and Worthing. Worthing break up the attack and there's a bit of space now for Chadwick. Here he is on the ball. Going over halfway, that's a lovely ball through. It's Starkey, round the keeper. Is it going to be a finish? What a block that is. Jake Elliott coming across. Louis Rogers has come a long way out of his goal. He's thankful to his defender. The keeper, the score's level. Oddy Starkey rounding the keeper. Tight angle. Great defending. Dixon with a foot in. The chance for Gabode on his right foot. Goes for it. Just past the post, now diving. Dixon just stumbles over the ball. Chadwick gets in, and breaks through the second channel. Chadwick through on goal, left footed. What a save from Lewis Rogers. Fine goalkeeping, read the danger. Denied Finley Chadwick. Does well to bring that one down. He's got the better of his man. Just gets it across the face of the box, and that's a clumsy looking challenge. And the referee points to the spot. Sam Adams took a touch, got in front of his man. Friendly Chadwick brings him down. Adams from 12 yards sends Harrison Mell the wrong way, and Hastings United take the lead. Just before the interval, he kept his cool, calm composure and side foots it into the side of the net. Just inside the post, Hastings United won Worthing nil. Flipped on by Splat. I think trying to look for an immediate response is Lee. Got support on the outside with Beresford. Beresford inside. Has he been brought down? Yes, he has. Penalty given. Two penalties in a space of two minutes. And that was an awkward looking challenge, a clumsy looking challenge, and Beresford went down. So Splats with a chance to level from 12 yards. Sends the keeper the wrong way. And Worthing are level just before the break. Two penalties. One apiece. And that's the scoreline. Hastings United one. Worthing one. Javian Splats. Picked over the top from Scott. Lovely from Worrell. He's looking for options over on the left hand side and he's got it with Adams. Adams on his right foot. Looks to go for goal. Too close to Mayo. Didn't quite get enough on it. Just open up for him though. Starkey. Still was it there? Into the feet of Jammer. For options, Hastings well organised. And I think need to go on the outside. Starkey wanted it short. And he's on the outside, can cut the ball across. Deflects out. Here's O'Brien. Gets it out of his foot. O'Brien with a shot, and that's a deflection that takes it just over. Carl O'Brien close for Worthing. Time ball forwards from Pope, former Worthing man, gets the return, clips it towards the back post, flicked away, ball's going to break and that's deflected and just going to drop wide. Danger all over yet though, here's Scott, Pope can turn, Pope can strike, straight into the arms of Harrison Mayo. Deep corner to the back post, and it's going to break here for Pope, who's out of the way. Hole! Oh, straight into the arms of Mayo. Oh, that was a chance for Hastings United right before the final whistle. And there indeed it is. Hull's chance just before the end. This game's going to go to penalties for the right to play Bogner Regis Town in the final. It's finished Hastings United 1, Worthing 1. Bud 
First penalty for Worthing, and he's hit the post! The Hastings United fans cheer behind the goal. First blood goes to Hastings United. Darren Budd rattles the woodwork. Can Pope capitalise on that miss? What a save from Mayo! Diving to his left. Strong arm to keep out Ben Pope. Score still level. Thompson up next for Worthing. Purposeful run and fires it into the roof of the net and finally we're underway. Worthing edge in front. Firm strike. Dixon rolls it into the corner. Never looked like he was going to miss. Sent the keeper the wrong way. We're level again. So Bryant takes a purposeful run up and sends the keeper the wrong way. Slots it into the corner. Knew exactly where he wanted to place it. Worthing 2 1 up. Here's Hull who had that brilliant opportunity just before full time and he sends his penalty into the corner. Two apiece. Jammer. Casual looking run up the stutter. The keeper goes the wrong way once more. And Worthing regain their advantage. Waited for the keeper to make a move before firing it the opposite way. Well, takes a second to compose himself and the keeper doesn't move. Side flips it into the bottom left hand corner. To get into the business end of the penalties now, it's Chadwick for Worthing. Left footed, right into the side netting. Pressure is now on. Perfect penalty. The boat has to score. Mayo trying to put him off. Well, that was cool. Carl Gomposen just kissing the post. He puts his fingers in his ears. That's a lovely, calm, casual penalty. Splat scored in normal time, but can't score in the penalty shoots out. Advantage Hastings United. It was a soft looking penalty. Keeper guessed the right way. He thought it was going to go underneath him for a second. A do the chance to win it for Hastings and send them through to the final. And Mel guesses right. Mail drived, guessed correctly, and Adu squanders the opportunity to put Hastings into the final. Beresford sends the keeper the wrong way. Worthing lead by five to four. Elliott. Against Mayo, it's soft and Mayo saves it again. It's three saves for Mayo and Worthing are going through to the final of the Sussex Senior Cup. They're playoff bound in the National League South and now they're Sussex Senior Cup final bound. They finished off the 90 minutes. Hastings United won, Worthing won. But Worthing threw on penalties and what a final we'll have at the Amex Stadium on the 11th of May.